What is going on guys? Grave here. Today I want to talk about something that's going to be a big change for a lot of Call of Duty fans out there. If you're a big fan of Call of Duty multiplayer, if you plan on picking up Call of Duty Vanguard, there's going to be one thing that you're going to notice that's not really been in Call of Duty before, and that is suppressors will not keep you off the minimap. Uh, instead of the suppressor keeping you off the minimap, there will now be a new ammo type that will keep you off the minimap. And there has been discussions uh, within the reveal trailer uh, for multiplayer and that kind of thing about the different ammo types you, you will have kind of in game that can benefit you in different ways. And it seems in uh, Call of Duty Vanguard multiplayer, the subsonic ammo will be what kind of keeps you off the minimap like the traditional suppressor used to. So the subsonic ammo uh, will provide no minimap ping, no enemy skulls, and firing uh, visibility to enemies. Now they did not give any of the downsides to this. I'm sure there will be some downsides, probably, you know, what you're usually expecting from a suppressor unless they're going to make you pair this with a suppressor they did not really go into those details too much you may have to run subsonic ammo with a suppressor so then you would get the negative benefits of the suppressor but the positive benefits of the subsonic ammo i'm not quite sure if that will be the case or if you can just put subsonic ammo on a weapon without a suppressor and it will work the same i'm not quite sure how that's going to work uh no real concrete details from uh, sledgehammer just yet but they did come out and say that subsonic ammo will be what gives you the benefits of staying off the minimap. So it kind of raises the question of if they're not going to make you run a suppressor, kind of what's the point of having them in game? I'm not quite sure of that either. Uh, and like I said, unless they both have to be paired together. Um, I guess a, a suppressor in Vanguard will be used uh, for more like a recoil control is kind of what it's being hinted at instead of just, you know, being stealthy and staying off the map. Uh, also, if you're running the radar park, you know, that will, you know, ping enemies on the minimap. Uh, you'll still be able to see uh, enemy shots from weapons with a suppressor even at that point. So, you know, I talked about in yesterday's video that the radar perk would be available. The radar in-game is going to be like Modern Warfare's, where you cannot see enemies when they're firing a unsuppressed weapon. But this means if a, a player is running the radar perk, you will still be able to see them running a, a suppressor even in-game because they're not going to have that, you know, subsonic ammo on for just using a suppressor. The suppressor is not going to remove them from the minimap in general. So it seems like Sledgehammer is kind of changing it up a little bit. Uh, I'm not quite sure how a lot of people are going to feel about this. Um, most people are used to running a suppressor and being able to stay off the radar. And now you're actually going to have to run a different ammo type. And it seems like, once again, suppressors, unless they have to be paired with that subsonic ammo, it's like suppressors are going to be mainly just for maybe recoil control because they're not really going to help you whatsoever uh, in the situation of being stealthy and staying, you know, keeping your dot off the map. You're actually going to have to have that subsonic ammo to be able to do that. Anyway, guys, leave me a comment with your thoughts. Of course, if you like the video, hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. Be sure to check out everything down in the description, the community discord, my Twitter, and of course, the affiliates here on the channel, Empire Jerky and Amazon Associates. And I'll catch you all next time. Peace.